All right, what's up everybody? It's Leeds and we're back for some more Mass Effect 3 multiplayer taking requests from you all in chat when it comes to your characters, weapons, enemies, and arenas. Plenty of spots here if anyone would like to hop in and uh, nothing in particular that we have set up for this match. So if there's anything you'd like us to do, then let me know and we can make it happen. Let me make sure I've unmuted myself in Discord. Ha, jokes on lids. I never muted myself to begin with. <gasps> Living dangerously, I know. Okay, so anything we're looking for here otherwise i mean i guess we'll just open up a pack while we ponder things it's about to say we have done a lot of melee stuff today already so maybe we mix it up a little bit here we could go I mean, if we don't have anyone else from chat who's looking to jump in, then this may turn into a match in which we either open it up to pugs or hop into an existing pug lobby elsewhere, in which case we probably want to take a character that we feel relatively okay with running if everything goes horribly wrong and we need to be carrying pretty hard. I feel like it has been a while since I last played base human adept. And I really like this character. It has been too long. Too long, I say. So tell you what, let's do this, and before we finish setting him up, let's... We'll make this lobby public, we'll see if anyone happens to hop in while we're doing all these things. How are we doing on amps? Assault Rifle 3, Pistol Amp 3, or rather 4. <laughs> I can read, I swear. 4 and 4. <laughs> it will be 3 once we do this. Uh, we might do... Lancer, or we might do Acolyte. We did do Acolyte earlier today, so maybe we go Lancer now. Although, it is kind of nice to go Commando Package. So you can get the double dipping a bit, and obviously that would lead us more in the Acolyte direction. Okay, let's see. So no one has hopped in just yet. So let me know if anyone from chat would like to do so. Otherwise, we may be about to jump into a random public lobby and just see what happens. I think we're prepared for the worst. Decent. Oh, actually, double check. Yeah, we did have Lancer equipped last time. Let's swap this over because we definitely did do the other things to align better with you. Okay. So yeah, let's jump out. We'll hop into an existing lobby and we'll we'll see what happens. You never really know. We'll try to go for a gold match, and if we can't get one of those, then we'll go for whatever difficulty we can find. Alright, but we have something. Duo with a random pug? They're going... Huntress? I mean, that, that's not bad. They have an acolyte? Great move. Great move. This person knows what they're doing. I didn't see, did they hard set it for any area or enemy? Okay, well this is possibly the worst thing we could have gotten on both accounts. Certainly at least the enemy. We'll see how the quality of their host is. Hopefully it's not bad. Contact! Oh, hello. Singularity. 
I was close. Did we get you? Yeah, we will. Or not. Grab. Oh, I mean, I guess that works too. I mean, we did do it to ourselves. That's something now. I can't see where that enemy was, but uh, look, we're fine. We're fine. Everything is fine. Of course, there's always a chance we'll get some additional random pugs hopping in here as well. Where did they spawn? They spawned over here. It's not a great singularity. I will admit, not one of my best singularities. What the heck happened to you? Went to the area where I did not want it. Really, still alive? Shields down. Okay. I, oh, hello. We'll take it. Are hunters. I should have fast uh, to ops back. And I should have. Ow. Also ow? We'll jail. This is kind of a nasty spot to the point where I might even do this. Wow, okay. That's thanks, Singularity. That's not the cleanest wave we've ever had. But hopefully we can clean it up from here. Oh, that's not what I wanted to see, though. That's probably not what we wanted. Uh, that's also not a good sign. Okay, don't. Uh, just lay the bombs. Don't lay the bombs, please. Come on. Split second longer. Just need a split second longer. Okay, this no longer works. We now need to kite them away. Yeah. Hey, Pyro. Hey, Pyro. What? <laughs> the, the pyro that wasn't looking at us? Is there a different pyro? Alright. This is the first one, so we kind of really need to get this done. Okay. This might be already... A guaranteed loss. Not not to be a pessimist or anything, but it's not, not exactly enough to a great start here. We got a random additional pug, and honestly, just getting someone else to distract the Geth is huge. Singularities, though. They really need to start actually hitting their intended targets. I did see that coming. Thank you. Oh, you're still here? Okay. Far side. Oh, and another person. We're fine. We just needed to wait it out long enough. To get our reinforcements, right?
Who do we get? Is that a GI? I think so. Is that a Mantis GI? No, Jabba GI. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. Oh, I thought I heard a Krogan of some variety is the other person who joined us. Oh, no, Batarian. Batarian, that was Lash. Is it a warp? Are you an adept? If so, then that is pretty nice. We have a lot of biotic stuff going on. Yeah. Look at this, we got the biotic stuff going on. Once the whole squad rolls up, we are totally fine. We just we just needed more friends. I don't know if that is the range. Not quite. That's unfortunate. There's a lot of enemies there. enemies here. Somehow that did not hit any of them. And away he goes. Where is he? Oh, so much for that guy. Oh, this guy is supposed to be the Black Sparrow. Totally a reference that Captain Jack Sparrow, I'm assuming. <laughs> oh, hello, friends. There's a lot of you over there. Oh, that's not where I want to bet. That is. here that's causing trouble. Oh, ow. Where, where is this? But where's this hunter? I hear him. I don't see him. There he is.
excuse me. <laughs> Things like that. Makes me wonder, what is Singularity doing? Worth it though. He's dead. You're not though. Well, so much for rolling out of the way that. Where'd they spawn? Where did they spawn? Well, I found them. <laughs> I found that one. Oh, and this is Diet Cola, just spelled differently. Clever names, clever names. Also, uh, nobody wants to revive us, unfortunately. Thanks, Singularity, for not getting the enemy directly in front of me that I was trying to target. Me, was yes, going to do that. Thank you. Ow. Worth it, maybe. Who was this person running from? Oh, well, hello to you two. Uh. Thank you, GI dude. All clear. Good work. Enemy is still active. Stay alert. Bogey's incoming. step part where you curve out of the way of everything that was directly in front of you. Yeah. Clear. Good work. Stay alert. Enemy is 
not hit. Nor did that. I don't know how. Someone explain that one to me. <laughs> Someone explain that one to me. That's not a thing. I wish it was. Oh, that was also a little bit curious. Never gonna detonate, but yeah. Who cares? We got the job done. We have some important enemy personnel in the area. I'd like to switch the target if we can. Which means I would like for that prime to be closer to other types of enemies. Okay, that works too though. Definitely did not hit. Oh, that was interesting. Not a map where I tend to get very many grabs, but we'll take it. Wave 10 nuke for kill streak thing? That's not a very good shot. And for that reason, was probably one kill away for. Oh no, it was a kill streak. Okay. Worth it. Confirmed in that case. Oh, see Daisy. Oh, 
I would like to. Number of times I pressed singularity there, nothing happened. <laughs> it was at least three. Probably gel. Uh, yes, I should definitely gel this. Is there one over there? Oh, well, there's so guys. There are those guys. Now jealous, which is kind of terrifying. And that killed absolutely nothing. <laughs> Just in case, you know? Just in case. But yeah, once we got our reinforcements, we were pretty much fine. So let me know if there is anything that, or anyone who would like to jump in here, in which case we would have to create our own lobby again. Or if there's anything you'd like me to do. Granted, as we saw there, little bit, at least initially, of a need for us to do some heavy lifting. Now we've got the full team. That, we should be fine. We don't have any soldiers. Oh, we did do a Geth Trooper at the very beginning today. What if we do? What if we do Batarian Soldier? Let's go for him, and maybe obviously we'll take grenades with some variety. Just not sure if we want to go shotgun route, or if we want to go. Okay, apparently we have a, an Eviscerator equipped. Sure, we'll run with it. So we will go the shotgun route. And we will take Shock Trooper. We might want to switch the Eviscerator to something else. <laughs> uh, they're about to start this up. Okay, let's throw on Cyclonic. Let's throw on... I did not check if we had armor piercing or not. Okay, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to stick with this. <laughs> Abyss Raider it is. Probably in a pug lobby would have preferred to have gone something with go with something that's a little bit stronger, just in case. This location has high value what if this raider isn't too bad? Okay, but like this, this is kinda of what I mean. Things Order. may go horribly wrong against collectors in a pug lobby. We will see. We will see. Also, totally shot that as if I was uh, charging up my acolyte because, uh, well, we were using that light last time, and I started doing that again as well. Swarm greeting. Grabbing here, like Most of 
those situations, you would want to grab him. Excuse me, sir. One moment. Just wait. Oh, just wait for it. Just wait for it. Just wait for it. Worth it. Confirmed. Is there not? Nope. The other dude is over here. Wait for it. You go for this grab. Oh, wait. You go for this grab. Alright, you know, we'll take it. Wave in which we basically exclusively got grabs? Works for me. That makes me a little nervous. Oh, it's going this way. I knew that. maybe not kill all the enemies behind us. This is nice and peaceful over here. It's a nice, pleasant little stroll. Of course, I was expecting a Praetorian to sneak up behind me right as I said that. That doesn't quite count, I don't think. It's not quite as devious as I was thinking we might see a Praetorian beat. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Worth it. Get one bar of HP? Worth it. Doesn't matter. Uh, where did our grenade go? I don't know. <laughs> you tell me. Through the grenade! Enemy is still active. Stay alert. Incoming. With pleasure. Sounds like they're on the far side. Over here. Grab opportunities. Hold on. Come hither. No, ignore them. Don't flank. Don't. Blank me. That's rude. Seriously. Oh, there we go. Okay, but pick a side. Except pick a side. Except pick a side. Wait for it. Patience is key. Patience is key. Patience is key. No! That didn't count! How could they? How could they? The absolute nerve of that individual. And then they flip away. Like they didn't do anything at all. Granted, it wasn't that person who stole the crap from us, but... Rude? 
Excuse you. There is also definitely a Praetorian behind There is absolutely 100% a Praetorian behind us. But I had to prove a point. The more important thing was to prove a point. Oh, well. That's happened a lot. We put the, the sphere down there. Oh, okay, you know, I'm I'm used to the that, that's gonna set off the shield. Um, I'm used to the defensive spheres, but to be fair, most people use it offensively, and that is probably the more so the uh, the consensus quote unquote correct way to do it. So fair enough. Okay, but it would be nice if the people who are standing, you know, very close but not quite in the objective circle could actually step into the objective circle. Oh, oops. Speaking of which. What's that? Precisely nothing. Hello. Uh, were we here though? Because I don't think we were. Did they gel in time? I don't know that they did. Oh, hello, Praetorian behind me. Nice to meet you too. saw the person who we were concerned about it, potentially having gotten stone. Explosive punch. That was probably not. Yeah, that was not necessary to chill there, but so be it. grenades at them. More like throw grenades at them, specifically. Hold on. No! Leave the abominations alone. They did nothing wrong. Where are the abominations? What have you do What are you doing to the abominations? Look at that. It was an innocent abomination. Watch it! That was interesting. <laughs> uh, the Ophos Ops packs. Not only did we get the sound, we got the visual effect as well. Yeah, I, I very much did that to them. Well, except. Oh, 
Look there. I don't know if that's a kill streak. Was it? Maybe if we got here. But we didn't. However, it is a grab. More importantly. Come on, come No, you wouldn't. Fine. Have it your way, then. We'll get you over here. You see another dude? Apparently not. Sir. Please come back this way. Please come back this way. No. Don't be like that. Oh, also there's a sign over there. But also, there's this dude. There is also this dude. No way, sir. No one invited you. people here to be grabbed. And by that I mean there are a very high concentration of people who can be grabbed. Let's see, Praetorian, you're not grabbable. There's definitely a Praetorian over here as well, although they might have just killed it. Okay, hold on, we've gotten his attention. Go and now we can- Oh, what the heck just happened? What was that? This one's pretty clear. Oh. Well, I mean... Nope, 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 nope. This, this. Now we'll help with the... Oh. Okay, maybe not. Now we'll help with the objective. Okay, you're up next, don't worry. Uh, excuse me, sir. Sir. There we go. Just ignore all the boss enemies. Go straight to the objective. And call it a day. Um, now that's not ideal. 
but we're fine. Oh. And you're fine. Oh, not like this, though. Now that does complicate things a bit. Spawn in that corner. It would seem. Oh, don't do that. Never mind. Just casually ballistic blades the wall. Everything is fine. I totally knew that was there. Do we? Do we do it? I was gonna put your shield on. Oops. That did hit ya. Did hit ya. Ish. Still nothing over there. Assuming that was a repair matrix. Should it. Probably. I hear that Praetorian sound. I may have killed our friend. Excuse me? We're fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. So we may have gotten a little distracted on that one. May have perhaps prioritized grabs above all else for a little while. A little while. But there's nothing wrong with that, right? There's nothing wrong with that. Alright, so let me know. If anyone from chat would like to uh, hop in the lobby with me, we are, of course, currently pugging it up, so we would need to break off and start our own lobby again, but that's no problem. Otherwise, we can continue to bug. We could continue to do this, of course. I guess let me know if there is anything you'd like me to do in particular, but of course, can't really compel the pugs to play a certain way. Try as we might. And these guys, yeah, they all readied up last time before we were truly ready to go, so we might need to, yeah, think quickly if we want to change things up here. What if we go, it's a little risky in a pug lobby, but we'll go Geth Engineer, because we are very squishy, but we don't play this guy that often. Weapon-wise, what the heck? What the heck? Crusader? Sure. A little heavy, but we'll take it. I did not... Ah, uh, we've built in piercing, right? So we definitely don't need our piercing on the weapon. Ammo, and then here... I mean, it is heavy, so maybe we go efficiency because we have so few shields after uh, executing hunter mode that it's not as if Cyclonic's going to make a huge deal. I think we go incendiary, wherever that is. There you are. 
What did we just gain? We just got a new destroyer. And you were previously a hunter, is now going paladin. You're the AIU who's now going Asari Adept. Oh, did everyone try going, or at least you tried going biotics after we were going. No, it, it's not as if we were doing biotics last time. Okay, so it's not like we pulled the rug out from under them or anything. Okay, London Cerberus. It's a little scary. Oh, so we, we went from one snap freezer with an AIU last time to a different snap freezer. This time. Ah. So the... I think we only have one chain on our overload, but that's still a good combo. Oh. Okay. That's step one. Step two as well. Clean sweep. Well done. Enemy is regrouping. Enemy force approaching. Guardians. Okay, thank you so much for taking cover. This is uh, probably along the lines of what we should expect is a, a light breeze will kill us. right in front of me. Okay, really though? Oh, when I was not. Little slow on the gel. They're fine, right? 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 They can handle this. It. 
also totally forgetting that you can shoot multiple times with the Crusader before you need to reload it. Thinking of it a little too much as the shotgun sniper rifle. Okay, up there? No, down there. Okay, I, I... Overload has left chat. Oh, I cannot... Okay. Oh, that's not good. Okay, things are very quickly falling apart here. I also ops pack... Alright, you know, <laughs> at a certain point, there are only so many times when... I can press buttons and them do and not have the proper thing happen and us still get the job done. Blown through a ton of cons gel specifically. Here they come. Processing. There's no one over there. There's a lot of people over here. Ow. Ah, I see. Lovely. Also, <laughs> we have uh, recreated a early 2000s dance move. Okay, we're about to use our second to last gel. Love that. Love that. Anticipate that he's gonna keep on roll moving when he doesn't. Okay. <laughs> I've about had it with this match. <laughs> Every single thing that could go wrong is going wrong. Our last gel. Ops back, and I will resort to this. That is a turret, which will kill us right now. Okay, I <laughs> am feeling the strong urge to. Start our own lobby. Suddenly. Is this person? Yes, this is the only person up right now. It's a paladin. He has the snap freeze. There is that, of course. But beyond that, we shall see as there is still a fair number of enemies remaining here. They may still be respawning as well, because, uh, I mean, we killed 
very small. I don't even know how many, if any, we killed, to be honest. Then most of the other squad mates went down pretty quickly as well, I think, on this wave. This is not quite full-blown soloing an entire wave territory, but it's not that far away from that. Not a terrible idea. Double Atlas. I'd be curious to know. I don't remember if they took get scanner. So they did do some pretty effective snap freezes few through walls, but wave complete. So there's that. Okay, let's just get this first one done and dusted. Oh, did everyone leave the lobby? There's a non-zero chance that everyone else left the lobby. One of the people left the lobby. Well, that's convenient. And they are also kiting all the enemies over there. So if they can just hold down the fort, that is very useful. That's not a phrase I want to hear, though. Okay. That's the, that's the nature of being off host. Thought we had enough time to run back up on our screen, but nope. And we've already used our last gel, so this is our life now. And by that I mean we are dead now. <laughs> is the other person still up? No, they are not. Lovely. Fantastic. Nemesis, two engineers. I thought there was an outlet from the far south map, but maybe not. Oh, there's a phantom. There was a phantom. They're acolyting it up with the... I mean, I'll never diss the Acolyte, but I feel like that is a bit of an odd choice with it. Oh, also they were shooting at us, kind of, sort of. So that was wave six. Those are a whole lot of fandoms. Honestly... I didn't even, uh, I, wow. <laughs> wow. I guess the engineer behind us is what killed us? Apparently. I was like, you know what? We might not be long for this world, so I'm gonna nuke and maybe take out a fair number of enemies, and at least we have done that. And that is all we will do, because once again, we are immediately getting stomped. Um, yeah, get me out of this lobby as quickly as possible. nothing against these guys but it's just everything it's like the we have buttons that aren't working we have also things like this happening and yeah you are the only person left so we are gonna have a slow and completely anticlimactic end to this run so let's abandon ship And to be fair, we perhaps got a little clever. I think the other person left as well. Yeah. We got a little clever taking a really squishy character off host in a public lobby. That was probably asking for trouble. And we maybe got a little overly confident after we got the full team last time. We we're like, okay, you know, we can do whatever here. And 
no, we could not. So let's make our own lobby in that case, and we'll have plenty of space in that case if there is anyone from chat who'd like to hop in here. Otherwise, I mean, we can go and turn this into a, a public lobby, just in this case, thankfully, we'll at least be hosting, so there is that much working in our favor that was not working in our favor before. I don't know how many consumables we have right now, but I have to imagine after a few rough matches, might be running a little bit low on the gels. So maybe... Let's go equip and pack here. Just in case. Okay, that should put us in much better shape, because, yeah, before those packs, we were probably running pretty low on the gels. Okay. So, now that we have our own lobby, if anyone would like to jump in here, we certainly have room. If anyone would like to make a request, I mean, at the moment, obviously, it's just me, so... I don't know. <laughs> if we're about to do a, a solo, I'd rather not do a gold solo right now. Maybe we bump it down to silver or something. We could do that, but... Wanna, what if we were to do that? It has been a while since we last done a solo, I suppose. What character would we want to do it on? Probably not someone as squishy as the Geth Engineer. What if we did... What if we tried... A Krogan Sentinel Silver Solo. Uh, nothing too crazy. I mean, it's just silver, right? But it's a character that for a while I was not a huge fan of, because as we were saying earlier today, I'm just not really a huge fan of the lift grenades, but or was not a huge fan of lift grenades. But now that I've spec them all the way and just gone pure damage, turns out that a uh, 2137.5 is a lot. And throw some kind of power magnifier on top of that and throw on maybe some kind of uh i could go power amplifier here i suppose if we really want to but we should probably take grenade capacity for this rather than direct damage wait what weapon did we have though there's the acolyte um so lift grenade only actually li I mean, don't really need to be worried about it lifting all that much, right? So don't think we need to be super concerned about stripping shields with an acolyte before using the lift grenades. Probably just go with really any pistol. Well, or SMG would of course also give us access to a power magnifier. I mean, I don't think we need to be super optimized here. If we're just going silver, I think it's fine. So we could maybe do something like... Maybe an eagle. Take a little bit of piercing. We should get the magnifier that... Let's go. Magnifier here. And then we'll take the piercing. Or do we want piercing rounds, and then we'll just go base damage here. Maybe we do that, actually. Because otherwise, well, we have Incinerate is our other power, right? So the Lift Grenade isn't great for combos, but the Incinerate certainly could be. What do we do for Incinerate? Okay, that is fully spec'd. That is fully spec'd. So sure, we'll get a little greedy on the power amplifier, which I... <laughs> on silver is probably going to mean that we're going to one-shot pretty much any and everything that is not a boss, and that probably means that it is serious overkill, but so be it. Alright, so yeah, we'll do... We'll do a silver solo. Do we want to 
lock in a specific enemy. I mean, anyone that can sink in sneaky ways, like phantoms and the Praetorians creeping up behind us, are a little concerning. So we could hard set for Reapers or for Geth, although Geth is not... Well, again, like the shields, do we need to be super concerned about that? Probably not that much. I feel like we haven't gotten much in the way of Reapers. I'm kind of leaning toward that. Maybe we do lock that in in whatever location. I mean, now we'll probably end up getting Condor. And, uh, let me just double check. That looks good. That looks good. Okay. So yeah, hopefully we don't get Condor, because that is bad for grenades, but anything else I think we'd be pretty much fine with. Including the map that we just had. Uh, two matches ago. Two matches. Okay, so, Silver Solo. It's been a long time since we've done any solos. So, you know, nothing too crazy here. Not going for the gold solo. Certainly not plat solo, but... So... Uh, we also could go crazy for the grabs if we really wanted to on the first few waves here. That is kind of sort of an option. Maybe, maybe not quite to the extent we have been doing it though. Also, I should activate this. But it's just there are so many grabbable enemies. They're all just hanging out here. So surely it was it was meant to be. What I'm saying is surely... What I'm saying is surely it was meant to be. Ex excuse me? Okay. I'll try, I'll try please. Thank you. In-game metal turn for the grabs. Nice. Oh, it's progress order, but not completion. Okay, we may... Maybe getting a little carried away with blowing through our our ops packs and what have you, but I mean, there's just so many gravel enemies on this wave, right? That guy's solely with throw a grenade rather than walk up here, right? You're fine though. Well, there is a grenade. Don't back up. No, I saw it coming. Yeah, it was either an ops pack or we were gonna need a jump. Oh, it looked like we were going to the cannibal animation for a second there. I was very confused. Oh, they're right on top of each other, so we can't get the grab. Hold on. Ideal timing? Question mark? No. Not ideal timing. So that's 10 grab. Oh, well, might not be 10 grabs because we might have been thrown into one of those animations before. Stop throwing your grenades. It's rude, and I don't appreciate it. Hello, friends. Okay, I was kind of hoping that, you know, you wouldn't, you wouldn't be that accurate. Also, our head is too big. What? We were invulnerable in the grab animation, were we not? Okay, that's it. That's it. I've had enough of this nonsense. Now we just go in and we try to actually hit these guys with the lift grenades, ideally. That was a kill streak. Okay, maybe it did hit the other people then. <laughs> there you have it. Lift grenade kill streaks. 
That was one enemy away from being killstreak as well, I think. So, you know, I didn't want to break out the lift grenades right off the bat. So I had a feeling they would be carrying us pretty hard. But, you know, when, when the grabs stopped working... That's when I knew. Playtime was over. Other side, other side. I'm telling you to go to the other side. So our melee kills number is not going to be an accurate reflection of our grabs because we have gotten several melee kills that were not grabs. But we do have a lot of grabs. Sweet, sweet. Well done. We definitely do still have a lot of grabs. But now things get interesting because this is our first objective. Oh, and this is not an objective that we like to see. But hey, maybe that means that we get rid of it on wave uh, three and we won't get it for wave 10 objective. Oh, opposite side of the map. Uh, that's probably a good thing, to be honest. Assuming that they were moving toward us before, that means theoretically this one should be pretty clear. Come on. Hey, Marauder. Okay. Let's speed our way over here quickly enough. I don't know. There are already definitely some enemies in this general area, which is not great. I don't think that Huss is going to be fast enough. Not often you get grabs on this spot. But we'll take it. Alternate grab objective. No, I wanted to grab you as well. Okay, is that down? Oh, yeah. So this is not a good spot. I'm not really sure where we do want to kite them. It's sort of in the middle, and it's hard to get them away from this spot. But we'll see if this is good enough. Stay away. Thank you. Alright, again, uh, yeah, our melee kill number is not going to be not going to be a great reflection of our grab, but wow, there's a lot of enemies here. Excuse me? Rude? That's what I think of you. That's 25. In terms of our actual grab number, it's probably not quite 20, but close to it. It's probably close to, or three kills. It's not two away from kill streak. Not that close, to be honest. Okay, but the pro the problem is we've obviously. Got a little lackadaisical with our consumable use as we've been messing around quite a bit. Got the, Got the eagle for a second. There. So now, can we a little more pragmatic? How we approach things going forward? I think we can. Once we get raptors, that's gonna be a bit of a pain. Where's this brute that I hear? Over there.
use the eagle that often, so it must be a terrible thing to get a few eagle points here. Yes, I know you're hiding there. Nope, we're doing this now. many headshots with the incendiary ammo. Yes, that is definitely well known to steal headshots. And again, we could always go back to lift grenades for the hard carry if we feel we need them. We do choose to go that route, then we just need to make sure that we don't put ourselves in such a bind that we've, you know, no ops packs, no gels, and there's still zero margin for error, because you never know. We'll still get surrounded by some enemies unexpectedly. Surely there are some enemies other than cannibals on this way? He says as he finds more cannibals. Oh! Yeah, no, definitely. There definitely are, as it turns out. Um, of the fairly strong variety, no less. That Banshee and that Brute took a very long time to announce themselves. So we get Banshees before we get Ravagers? Oh, that was not very nice of you. That's where you are. Also, that absolutely could be a grab, but... No, the Banshee's chasing us now. gonna be like this, then it's gonna have to be like this. Look, it didn't say that you're the lost enemy. Yeah. Because you are. Presumably. There we go. We could still get some grabs in every now and again, right? So now we know Banshees and Brutes are available, are, you know, possible to show up. Although this might be a Ravager wave and... Uh, okay, it's six, so it is an objective. True. Yep. Yeah, what? What enemy variety do we get this time? Cannibals are not surprising. What? Is it? Oh. Yep, the Ravagers are here too. Where from? Up there. Oh, it's true. Okay. I was gonna say, fortunately, fortunately, the uh, cover there was working pretty well for us to avoid the Ravagers, but 
the brute kind of disrupted that. Swarmers. Probably back to Banshees now. That's Banshee there, right? Yeah. So obviously all it takes is one Banshee. So we need to be careful of that. Only be now there's still one in Banshee. Oh dear. Look out for them. So Raptor. Might still be two Raptors. No idea where that came from. Banshee project up. Still, I think a tiny bit more than just the Banshee. It might be up here. It hasn't told us last enemy, and I thought there were still some stragglers over here somewhere. Ah, yeah. Just you? Might still be one or two more. Oh, well, well there is the Banshee. Something behind a swarmer showing up with the red life bar. World's best incinerate. Carriers back as well, that's no fun. Not realize that you can't dodge with this guy until this match. <laughs> Earlier in this match, but only just then was I able to. <laughs> Truly, take a second to go. Is, is this just me? Oh, that was the other guy who was there, apparently. There's still more? That wasn't the last person. Don't tell me the Banshee respawned. I'm reading only one more left. Got one more! What's up, Moldorka? 
We're currently just uh, chilling on a, a solo. We dumped it, bumped it all the way down to silver, so nothing crazy going on here. But we did some pug matches, and those pug matches did not go particularly well. So felt like, you know what? Oh, well, that's not what I meant. Maybe we just we just go solo. Shields down. Just kind of hoping that that happens to fall where I want it to fall. I don't think it did. Ow. Please stop that. Please stop that, too. We also may have got a little carried away in the first few waves. So, saying to ourselves, ah, it's just silver. Don't worry about it. And then just wasted a bunch of gels and, and uh, ops packs going for grabs. That may or may not have happened. Oh, hello. That was interesting. There was a Ravager over here. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. You can hit me from there. Okay, fair enough. I underestimated you. I'm not entirely sure where that Ravager was. Somewhere over here. You sniped me from way over there? And that's just impressive. That was husk on us. I am trying to vault this cover, though. Oh, well, so much for the potential grab. And you know what? Forget about that. Oh, hello. Yep, I, I was pressing the melee button, but no, we're gonna die because um, you didn't let me melee until this started. So there's always, oh, but we're gonna get a free revive though. Possibly, kind of, sort of. So there's always the chance that wonky stuff like that could happen, which is one of the reasons why we still should be, oh my God, things like this, which, Free revive? Yes, free revive. I guess we'll take it. <laughs> but playing with fire a little bit on that stuff. Uh, so yeah, I, I should be online on Origin, and we were, you know, we were doing some group matches before, just, uh, some people were taking a lunch break, and so I was, uh, hugging it up for a little while. Until now. What wave is this now? Is this, uh, eight? Oh, oh no, the Swarmers. Avager, I would like to get rid of you. Wherever you are. I saw the orange light bar for a second. Armor bar, but I can't. It's like down right below there? I don't know. That might have been it. Oh, that's also a Ravager. Yep, you know, we did kind of ask for that, but I am surprised that we survived. We did not deserve to- we did not deserve to survive on that occasion. Fair enough. Piercing, but those swarmers are also a concern. All of the ravagers are over here, confirm. Worth it.
Oh, hello, Banshee projectile. That is very far away from the actual Banshee who threw it. Shoot us in the back. Like you. Might just be the Banshee now. Might just be the Banshee now. can prime with our ammo and detonate like that. Well, had prime in the first place. Oh, that's not what I wanted to see. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right. Well, and this is another reason why we probably should have been a little bit safer on the earlier waves in case we got a really bad wave 10 objective because this could be very tricky first one we should be relatively safe from but let's see where the second one ends up where is that that is close by i don't know if we're fast enough here i don't think we're fast enough here also that delay was okay no this is not gonna work least the Ravager makes it. What the heck? Oh, did the Ravager go down there? Okay, well, that's even worse. Kind of, sort of. Yeah, let's just walk into the Swarmers and give them a hug while we're at it. Where did the Ravager go? I found where the Ravager went. So I want to kite them away. To this side of the map. Like I said, I'd rather not have to go through the middle. Ideally, the Banshees would chill, though. Because the Banshees right now have no chill. Okay, can we go for it now? Other side would be better, I think, for cover purposes. Because we know there's a Ravager there. Apparently it can't see us, so that's good. Because that was a tough one. Oh no. Can we do this quickly enough? Oh, uh, that brute's gonna... No, no we can't. Can't just come from that side. Okay, let's go this way. There is another Banshee. Somewhere. Okay, so we now want them over here. So we're going to chill for a little bit. Try to get them to come this way. And then... Should give us more time to get the objective. Theoretically. But they're... They're loitering over there quite a bit, it seems. Which is not great news for us. There's a raptor over here somewhere. It's like near the swarmers. The Banshees are coming. Now let's start making moves. Much more empty, it would seem. Besides you. I think we can tank this. Okay, nice. Where's the last one? Is that up in the middle inside? 
bay there will be enemies right here. There are. Including a banshee that's right in front of us. Or rather, a marauder around here that I just heard. Somewhere? No, he's up here. Where is he? Okay. I mean, could fight the banshees now, but I kind of prefer to put them away at some of the guys who are going to shoot us from afar first if there are any ravagers or marauders. He says, as both the ravagers and the marauders show up. Bad spot. We're out of ops. Havex. Want this Ravager. Need to get rid of the Ravager. Where is it? Hello, Banshee Projectile. a couple of the Marauders, really would have liked to have gotten more with that lift grenade, that was the idea behind it. I don't know if they're over there, they were in that general area before, so it was a blind grenade, but hey, you never know. Ah, Ravager with one bar of armor. I think I just saw. Where? Where? <laughs> Where is it? Oh, well. There's those guys. I mean, that's not a bad move, to be honest. Just because that's where all the enemies are right now. But yeah, we did get the Rapture. Okay. That's the main thing I wanted. And then, at the end, we can just try to isolate the Banshees. Although they are sneaking up behind us as we speak. I don't like this spot right now. I'd like to get rid of this Marauder as well. Wherever he is. Hello, another base projectile. Where's the Marauder? Okay, she's coming through there. There's a Marauder hiding somewhere. That's where he is. Okay, Marauder's down. So now we shouldn't have to worry too much about getting shot from far, except by the other bench. Shouldn't have uh, incinerated there. on that side of the we might have invited them to put on the shield. One down. Nope, this is nothing. Your barriers came back, how dare you. Of zero grenades. So be it. Two off. This way. What's up, Tark? We are currently doing a random silver so well, a silver solo, because we felt like it. <laughs> we did some pug matches, and they just left a bit of a sour taste in our mouth. So we were saying, you know what? Feels like we ought to just do a uh, a solo match. 
So it is silver. So, you know, nothing... Nothing too crazy. Don't get me wrong. We did, however, get a little carried away with uh, trying to farm a bunch of grabs on waves one, two, and three, which did lead to us using a lot of consumables. One might use the word waste, but you know, that's a... Uh, it's a matter of perspective, really. So that made things a little more interesting as time went on. Hello, warming Banshee projectile. And it's just been a long time since we've done it so long. Of any variety. So the upper... LZ. Yeah, like, farming grabs? I, I would never do such a thing. So, you know, if I was doing it, then surely it was very minor and we absolutely did not get carried away and use almost all of our consumables in the process. We would never do such a thing. Uh, that would actually could have been a problem if that out if that husk grabbed us might not have gotten to the LC in time <laughs> actually the biggest risk right there but otherwise totally fine totally fine You know, don't read into how the first metal showing up here is grabs. That's a mere coincidence. Mere coincidence that there's grabs and then melee kills. That is definitely not something that you should read into. But anyways, we can, uh, well, obviously we have room if anyone would like to hop in here and we can bump it back up to, you know, gold if that is the difficulty of choice. Suspicious look. I don't know what you're talking about. I would never do such a thing. Definitely. Very suspicious look. <laughs> Definitely not on the map that, at least once upon a time, I had stated was my favorite map for grabs. No. <laughs> no. Well, I would not never do that. How's it going, Tark? How are you? I am good. And uh, Moldurka was hanging out in chat a little bit as well. Moldurka, if you want to hop in here, you are welcome to do so as well. Saved you haven't been alone all evening, have you? Uh, no, we had some uh, we had some group matches earlier, but had a what maybe two or three that were pug matches and um, with some mixed success. <laughs> right. <laughs> may have had one that started off as a duo and it was a little questionable at the beginning but then we eventually got reinforcements and things turned out okay but i may have let that get to my head a little bit and assume that we could safely take a, a little more risky characters than you would usually like to take off host in a public lobby and it may or may not have backfired oh you weren't hosting either nope <laughs> Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe taking squishy characters like Geth Engineer was not a good idea. Well, at least you didn't go Vanguard. True, true. Alright, but we have Moldurka as well. So we have hey, Moldurka. We have three out of four spots, so we, we could do some stuff here if there's any particular things that people are interested in in setting up for this next one. We do have one more spot if anyone else would like to jump in. Uh, yeah, I'm up for whatever. Okay, let's see. Why Why is my Krogan soldier using the scorpion? Is this you again, Lids? I don't know what you're talking about. That seems like a perfectly reasonable thing to do. Alright. I see nothing suspicious at all. The scorpion is a very weird choice for a shotgun. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of like a shotgun with the explosions. Of Perfect. all the pistols, I mean, certainly... Talon is the most shotgun-like, but it's... it might be number two. 
I mean, you could compare the Executioner to the Crusader. Yeah, but like the Crusader is also a sniper <laughs> rifle <laughs> pretending to be a shotgun. Yeah. Shotgun in name only. I yeah. Guess. Uh, well, I'm gonna set up my Krogan soldier, and if uh, we find out we want to do something different, I'll just swap. All right. Yeah. Why don't we? Not seen anything from chat request-wise right now, so why don't we just go with whatever for this one? Let's see. So you you said Krogan you know, there, soldier. There, yeah. You know there is tr there, there there is three of us. I do remember one particular challenge that requires three people. Oh, uh, one that may or may not take place on the map. With hazard, <laughs> than I was just uh, on. May or may not do that, yes. Choice of scope being very important for certain people. Mm. Mm. Okay. Okay. Just, just, just mention <laughs> no, no, pre no pressure. Oh, uh, well. I don't, I don't know if Moldorka is familiar with that one. That one's pretty, that one's up there. That it's one is, rough, yeah. that might be one of the craziest challenges that we have made. I just feel like it, 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 it crashed and burned so badly last time. That and is partly true. Partly because Blasto had to leave. Uh, that is true. And I feel like, I, you know, of all the people to play with uh, having to be scoped in the entire time, I feel like Moldurka could, could pull that off. Not to force one of the specific three rolls on Moldurka, but I'm just saying Moldurka <laughs> is kind of good at that whole sniper rifle thing. Oh, nice. Maybe pick something. What did you pick again? Because you saw basically nothing, didn't you? I think I did the collector sniper rifle. Right. Just thinking that yeah. it was going to be a funny gimmick because it's such a weird weapon. But I did not realize that it had a crazy scope compared to other snipers. And I I was completely useless. <laughs> yeah. I could not see a like... single thing. Even when enemies attacked me and it showed the little icon directing me toward where the person is attacking me from, still couldn't find them. Yeah, there were a lot of uh, gray steel wall plating in your uh, <laughs> on your uh, stream. <laughs> there definitely was. There definitely was. I mean, if, if you're, I as I said, I'm not sure if Moldorka is familiar with this one, so Moldorka is probably wondering what the heck we're talking about. But if you're interested in trying that one out, then then we can explain it to Moldorka and potentially give it a go. Let, let's let's tell him, and he can. Uh... He can say if it's of interest or not, because okay. I would understand if it yeah. wasn't. <laughs> this one is crazy. Like, no question. Crazy. So, Moldorka, if you do not want to do this, fair. Let us know. We totally do not have to do it. But the way that this challenge works, it's called Three Blind Mice. The idea is everyone on the team has one specific thing that makes it really hard for them to see. So, for one person... Uh, well, let me first say that it will be on Dagger Hazard. So obviously that makes it hard to see because there's all the smoke or dust or whatever you want to call it. So there's that. Then one person has to stay in the very first spot where you land into the map for the entire game. That one little platform at the top of the stairs, you need to stay there the entire time. So basically, you can only see whatever you can see from that corner of the map. So that's one person. The second person must have a weapon with a scope and be scoped the entire match. The only time you're allowed to not be scoping is when you are reloading, and that is it. No exceptions. <laughs> That, that was sort of your rationale for the sniper rifle, wasn't it? Because it, you didn't ever have to un unscope the collector sniper rifle. Oh, yes! That's true. That was one of the reasons why I was thinking to go with the collector sniper rifle. But I think I think we were coming to the conclusion that it definitely was not a good choice when we tried this last time. So, oh, yeah. God. Person number one has to stay in the first area where you spawn in initially. Second person has a weapon with a scope and must stay scoped the entire match. Third person, their restriction is that they can never walk forward. They can only walk backwards and, I guess, sideways, meaning that they can't see where they're walking. And those are the three restrictions. So before we start up, we just say, you know, which role is each person doing? 
and then we give it a shot. So it is very gimmicky, very difficult, and uh, understandable if for that reason you're, you don't want to do it, uh, no problem. But if that sounds interesting, then we can give it a shot. So Tark and I, we've done it what? I think we've done it twice together. Yeah, the first time when you were the sort of stationary guy, I think we made it. I think we did, yeah. Not today. <laughs> okay, <laughs> said, No, thank you. Not today. No worries. Totally understandable. Okay, fair enough. So in that case, why don't we just go for a whatever match here. Take whatever you want. Yeah, I need to respect this guy quickly. Okay, no worries. Know. I have not decided what I'm going to take anyway. So, what have I not... Have I done much... Uh, I did do the Geth Engineer one that did not go particularly well. Maybe... Maybe I go for a Geth Engineer Redemption run? Okay. That sounds like overload. That definitely will be overload. Sounds like setting off my uh, Inferno Grenades. Oh, true. Yeah, no, that, that definitely works well then. Weapon was oh also I'm pretty sure that I uh, I mean Crusader's not bad of course but might want something a little bit lighter. Hmm. Oh Moldarka is bringing the GI. Leave something for the rest of us, please. <laughs> I'll go mix it up a little bit. I'll go Blood Pack Punisher. Uh, let's go... Like that. Are you sticking to Dagger, or...? Oh, let me switch that. Yeah, no, time. we don't have to do that. We can do... Oh, nope. That wrong button. <laughs> We can do unknown unless there's a specific one that you guys want. Well, I'm fine. There we are. Okay. Engineering kit, SMG amp. We'll go. Hmm. Power? Cells? We don't really have enough shields to warrant Cyclonic, I don't think. Alright, so, Tark, I'm just gonna assume that you're priming basically everything. So I... Well, to, to be honest, I'm, I'm running the uh, the uh, Claymore, so for Mooks, I'll probably just shoot. Okay. Uh, so for, okay. for I'll bosses, take... I'll be using the grenades and... Okay, so I'll take him out elemental ammo in that case. No. Okay. Enemy forces have been spotted. Secure area. Herbus. Good thing for this map. Yeah. Definitely is. Been a while since I've used this gun. It does take a little getting used to. Oh, you are not grapple. You are not grapple. You're still not. How dare you? How dare you? Are you farming grabs again? Maybe. This may or may not be objectively the best grabbing map after we test it out extensively. One moment. Nemesis. No, no, Nemesis, please, please hold. Please hold. Come back here. Hold on. Something's very wrong here. I've shot this trooper three or four times, so he's taking no damage. That does seem odd. Yeah. I don't know if it was a This guy running from you? Whatever. Oh, yeah, he is unkillable. You are right. He is headless! The headless immortal assault trooper. One more and it's a wrap. 
Oh my goodness. He I'm doesn't not, have I'm a head. He does not have a head. And he's unkillable. He seems unable to stomp me as well because he did the animation three times. How about a heavy melee? Nope. Yeah, my heavy melee goes straight through him. Is he headless for you guys as well? No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, I think we found Thanos. <laughs> Don't we may have. Oh, what the heck? What the heck? Is there anything we can... Oh, we need one of the brains to tell us about this, because I've never had this happen before. Can we grab him? No, that's how I died. I sort of, he was standing like right in the grab position. Oh, he, he fell through the map! Oh, <laughs> he knocked well, out of here. <laughs> Can't be arsed with this. <laughs> Just watch him so fall weird. right through the map. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, the headless assault trooper. <laughs> Who knows if he will strike again? Maybe not the safest place to be hanging out. When I have no health and my only tiny sliver of HP comes from my shields. Yeah, the shields go away fairly quickly on this map. Or with the rain at least. I'm gonna grab some shields before I run out the Oh, wait, what? What did this get here? Is the fastest of all the directions. Ow. Thank you. Oh, oh. Why do I have my missile launcher out? <laughs> well, Derka, we, we believe in you. Oh, oh. Bunch over here. Oh, Phantoms now. And that's a grenade that will Two kill me. Oh, and Bulldark as well. Nice melee. Nice. Whoa. Oh, that's a phantom as well. Uh-oh. Yeah, that, that's not great. Okay, I can chill. No worries, Mulder. Yeah, I will chill. No, thank you. Excuse me, sir? Oh, that's a turret. Heads up, there's a turret over there, Mulder. No turrets! 
Kids, say no to turrets. Ow. And dragoons, apparently. Oh, he flew away. Oh, it's so calm. No rain. It's peaceful. Found the phantom. All clear. Good work. Enemy is still active. Stay alert. Enemies inbound. Oh, yep, they're over here again. No engineer. Bad. Bad engineer. I probably shouldn't be all the way over here. Ow. I have no idea how much HP that Atlas had, but apparently it is now dead. That's where you're hiding. Okay. Say no more. That, no! Okay, hold on. That's at number two. I mean, you're never gonna run toward me, though. Nice. Oh, there's still an Atlas in here. Okay. Properly punished. <laughs> Trap time. Weapon plus two through armor. A lot of pizza. sound good. Oh, that's the sound of a turret somewhere. Ow. You were probably the one who made it. So I'm guessing it's over here. Just cautiously. Yep, I found it. Very One turret down. Can't say as whether there are more. Hopefully not. the one down here but yeah I got the one in the corner over there oh lots of people at LC oh you're right Ow. I may be able to get to you okay gracias let's maybe not stand here ow he says as he walks about five steps before he gets killed again Chill. Oh, Jesus. I backed straight into two turrets. Oh, y you are not wrong about that. Um, one in the lower I'm section. I'm going to nuke one. one of the turrets for you. Oh, and then die. I did successfully. Oh, then I immediately got stopped. What? He stuck up behind me. Oh, no. Oh, oh, this is so bad. I nuked one of the turrets away from you. The one in the corner, I think, but I don't know if there is another one. Yeah, there's one down there. If I can grab. Oh, 
Oh, fuck you. Did kill an engineer over in the middle area. Don't know if he left a turret somewhere else. Hopefully there not. Enemy is regrouping. Time to reload. Any presents they left behind? Doesn't, at least not down here. Doesn't look like it over on this side either. Oh, there is one over there. I found one. Yep, it's in the same corner. The one that they put all the turrets in, in this match. I'll just stay over here. Oh, that's not it's quiet doing. over here. Careful. Oh, I catch them. Is this the area? Well, I aimed for the athlete and I killed the phantom, so that's good, I guess. I would say get right. Doesn't seem good. Is there an atlas right here? No, it's just causing trouble, isn't it? I can't see through the smoke anymore. Oh, what was that? the turret that might still be there? Or that phantom? At least one phantom down here. Although I think Moldorka cleaned out a bit. There's an atlas or two over here. Yeah. Yeah, I can't see shit. Yeah, there's a lot of smoke. I'll try and flank him. Yeah, one atlas should be about to go down. Yep, I'm about to go down. Oh. Uh, cover. Save me. Maybe? Yes. Okay, now I'm gonna tell Moldark has got you. Theoretically, the hopefully. Use the nemesis is causing us some trouble. Speaking of nemeses, nemeses on this map, when the rain is going, is, um, it's an experience. Nothing on this oh, left side. The other, other side. Yeah, most I see there. a turret. Oh. I killed the turret. I... Nice. I think they're. Oh yeah, all DLC. Tons of phantoms. Surprised I was able to snipe a guardian from here. Phantom, two phantoms outside. Okay, Guardian, or rather, uh, Atlas coming on the right. And there's another one right here, isn't it? Yep. Got this sniper. Ow, jeez.
way your armor is red like that, and the way that I have hunter mode active has, on numerous occasions, that's turret, made you look like an enemy. That's two turrets. Oh, well, that's zero turrets. Sorry, what? Uh, you look like an enemy, in short. You look like an oh, enemy. Okay. I, uh... Don't kill me. Please. We get three pizzas? I think we got yep. three pizzas. Ah, uh, there's a lot of stuff over in that side. Be careful. Whoa. Is there another phantom somewhere? Because that will could not have killed me while flipping around. Yeah, there's one down here. Oh, there's one right in front of us. Right there. No shield. Oh, oh well. Mm, yeah. Uh oh. Oh. Okay. So that works. Oh, you have a phantom right on top of you. Yeah. And, and I have a phantom right on top of me. You. Oh god. No. Jesus. Oh, They're that? everywhere. Oh no, I revived right on top of phantom. Oh no. Oh no. Get out of here. I just want to do the objective. Ow. Oh, that's better. Okay, she's dead. Atlas here and Phantom. Okay, good idea. Uh, Atlas and Phantom behind us. Now I'm blowing through ops packs like crazy. Oh, it's right next to me. Nice. corner right on top of me that works Probably is not gonna work. Yeah, this is much taller than me. Hey. There we go. And I'm really tempted to nuke that. Just to see if I can get. The kill streak point? Nah, now they're all spread now. Opportunity come and gone, I'm afraid. Shuttle is on its way. We'll intercept an LZ. Okay. Coming from the other side. Oh, yep. Stand right in front of us. Behind you, Stark. He's dead. Don't worry about it. Now behind you, though. He's dead. Right. There will be. Oh. Look out. Seconds. seconds. Left side looks fairly clear. Okay. Did 
They are coming out of the central building now. This might be the first time I've ever taken cover on this spot. Well, if it works. Enjoy that. What? You don't like having non-stop turrets right on top of you, and then you gel, only to find that the turret is still there, so it's inescapable? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's the uh, Krogan with the very long cooldowns, and me not being very good with the Claymore. Mm. So, Claymore. Match, match made in, uh, well, somewhere. But we do have room for one more, if anyone else would like to jump in here and let us know if there's anything in particular you'd like us to do for this one. Otherwise, as we did there, we'll just go with whatever feels like fun. Yeah, I'm probably gonna regret it, but I'll give my, uh, Kishok a go. Oh, off host, that is bold. That is very bold. I do believe if you if you ever gonna do the performance and challenge, the Kishok is one of the nicest uh, snipers to do it with, since it has a very low magnifier. Yeah, that may be. I think it's only like twice, two, two, two x magnifying. And what is the collector sniper rifle? Like four or something? Yeah, I think it's sort of regular <laughs> magnifier with a lot of weird graphics. Oh, it's just weird, yeah. And maybe a narrower field of view than some of the other. I don't know. I, you're asking the person who has made it very clear that he's not a fan of using sniper rifles. Okay, so maybe I'll go... I might take a character that I haven't taken in a really long time. Flies under the radar quite a bit, I think. Wait, do I have more points to... No, I just spent this in a really weird way. Okay, um... Huh. Alright. I guess. Not really sure what to make of that, but sure. Let's try a unusual assault rifle while we're at it. Let's go. Mm, I mean, I don't use ADIS that much, but I think we can be a little more ambitious than that. Vindicator? Oh, I don't know. Argus? I might honestly have never used the Argus. I could not tell you if I've ever used the Argus before. I may not have. I think I'm good. Ooh, mixing up with the Wraith this time, Muldurka. Nice. Nice. Okay.
A strategically significant target has been located. Collectors, unfortunately, no hassle. I don't know if it's an automatic rifle or if it's a semi-automatic rifle. Hold on. It's semi-automatic. Okay. Good to know. <laughs> Good to know. round burst kind of weapon. It's just all pizzas. Got Oops, him. everything's a pizza. There was someone over here. Oh, there's also apparently a Praetorian over here. I should have known. I will jail. I will revive you, and then you will be very grateful that I have done that. Um, because I was going to do it right in front of that Praetorian. Ow. That might even kill myself. Might even make me force me to- Oh, God. <laughs> uh, lovely.
Sorry, sorry. Um, you can see what I tried to do. Squad member has flatlined. Go. Oh, goodness. Lovely. I also tried to grenade to blow up the possessed abomination on myself, but I was out of grenades. As to whether that was a good thing or a bad thing, I'll leave that up to you. I realized I turned my mic off like five minutes ago and it oh. to myself. I realized that I understand why people don't take the Argus. Are you taking a uh, grenade character, Tark? Uh, I'm, I use grenades, but not that many. Okay. Only for like boss. Well, it's just minding my own business, shooting a collector web in peace. Until the Praetorians decided to show up. Oh, no, that's where you were shooting me from. Alright, I'm just gonna let this one happen. <laughs> I think it's near the end of the wave. I know on the opposite side of the map. I was how to have a okay. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Sure you were. Well, I found all the mobs. I'm just gonna run straight past them. But for your information, they're on the other side of the reactor. Oh, you're not wrong. Uh, okay. Moldurka agrees. <laughs> I did hear some people sneak up behind us. I did not make that up. Oh, 
Not that I can do much about it. Yeah, thank you. I wanted to take cover. That's exactly what I wanted to do. Oh, well. Oh, that's a Praetorian. <laughs> it's like, why is there a wall right in front of me? What's that doing there? Oh. Something? What? Okay. I can chill. Oh, Mulder. Mulder. This is needed, and I'm taking this to mean that I probably should. That did not get the Praetorian, did it? Lovely. Oh. Oh, hello. Um. Maybe it's time for a missile? He has one Almost bar over armor. The What is Very Moldarka up? sneaky upload going. Is it just me right now? No, Moldarka's here. Okay. Oh, Moldarka's here, but it's okay, like... for a second there, I the <laughs> Not my best throw. There you go. Okay, well, well, the upload is done. So, there's- Ow! <laughs> the number of times this wave alone, where I've died instantly upon getting up, is alarming. Also, why no grabs? Yeah, you're getting all the aggro right now with the infiltrator next to you. True. True. Oh, hello. What's going on there? Did you just run past a uh, collector on top of another co collector? Huh? Oh, here's really? Here. You, can't, you, you can't see it? Like, right in front of you right now on my screen, there's nope. two collectors, one on top of the other. <laughs> I see nothing. I hear them, uh, but I see nothing. Yeah. It's a shame I can't... Well, I could share my screen, but... I don't know if Molder can see them. One of them just popped really, down and I was really able to weird. kill it. There he goes. I'll, I'll send you a screen, screen grab from <laughs> like right before the uh, waving. Somewhere over there, right? I think. Oh, you're in trouble. Completely out of gels at this point. I think I very well maybe. Just about sums up how this has been going thus far. Well, yep, I am out of gels. <laughs> Confirmed.
lot of ammo. Oh, he just wants a hug. Yes, no thank you. It's gotta have boundary. What's wrong with explosive hugs? LZ. Mm. Over here as well. Oh, oh, see Daisy. That was close. Okay, well, uh, in case you're wondering, the Praetorians are over here. Nothing at all to contribute. <laughs> Team member has gone dark. Of course, there are two Praetorians right on top of me, stopping to do some lasering. That's very convenient. Oh, don't worry, those are the ones I was saying hello to earlier. They're quite nice. Wait, what? <laughs> he, he walked away from me. How is he still on top of me? behind him. Yeah, there you go. Is it just me left? Oh, my over here. Yeah, he's on the opposite side. Scion at LZ. Plus a little bit. Might be two Scions even.
are grabbing me. Right. Hey, Tark. speaking a better wave for me at least I uh, did not die immediately before I could kill anything at all so I guess that's sometimes that's all that's you can hope you know at this point I think that's all I can hope for you're right oh come on he shot me before he turned the corner what is this Troopers. Only one more enemy. Outstanding work. Enemies well, regrouping. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't describe my own work as outstanding. I wouldn't go that far. Maybe it's outstanding, like you have an outstanding warrant. Yeah, you know, Let's go. more likely. This also looks vaguely familiar. Flag terror, right? I saw that door come from the same direction. Yeah, that is quite considerate of them. I, wow, appreciated that until they may have immediately upon saying that flanked us. Oh, they're coming from above. What? I hear troopers flying up and down. Oh, that was, um, that was a trooper right in front of me. That was silly of me. Oh, thank you, but look out. Oh, um, so, <laughs> yeah, that was not gonna end well for all, <laughs> damn it. Oh, uh, well, you know thank you. Honestly, I didn't deserve it, but thank you. I risked you on top of him, so I figured I, <laughs> how about it sort this out? <laughs> 
See if they all come through the reactor again. That would be nice. I was aiming for the oh, side. They are flanking, they are flanking. Might as well not missile our way through the reactor right now. Oh, sorry, I put it up on you. No, it had to be done. Wait, I what? I didn't <laughs> I get anyone to, else. No, I, tr I tried to freeze them <laughs> to keep them away from you, but either you or Malaka killed them. I I nuked them. <laughs> I waited. Ah. I tried to wait to the last second and nuke them. Granted, I should have oh. waited a little bit longer, but still, how did I not get anyone else? Oh, I ran away. <laughs> so far away. <laughs> I ran away and tried to freeze them, but uh, somebody had different plans, I guess. I was just staring at the ground, missile launcher out, counting down in my head. I mean, no, that was... I don't know how they got killed. It's a mystery. It is a mystery, indeed. Thanks, Baldurka. Have a good night. GG's. Oh, we lost our I win button. <laughs> I guess one of us could play the GI. Um, you know, I think I, at the very least, will probably not play either Battlefield 3 Soldier or the Argus for this next one. <laughs> oh. that, that would probably be beneficial. But if anyone from chat wants to jump in, we do have room. Let's see. Well, I like the B BF3 soldier. I just try and not play him like the regular human soldier. Yeah, I didn't really come in with much of a plan. And uh, the <laughs> Argus enough. Argus did not help with that. Yeah, the Argus is such a bad weapon. It's a burst weapon, isn't it? Yeah, three round burst. And uh, the right. damage is, is not really good enough to make that feel worth it. It's like the Valkyrie if the Valkyrie did no damage. Yeah, kinda. I think yeah, I guess that is the weapon that it it reminded me of something, but I couldn't quite put my finger on which one it was. But it's probably the Valkyrie that I was thinking of. Valkyrie has uh, three round bursts, yeah. Mm -hmm. Although it's much more accurate than the Argus and does a lot more damage. Yeah. Actually, I don't remember how accurate the Argus uh, is. Is it accurate? I mean, it does it have a lot of recoil? It has some. Um has some recoil in terms of actual accuracy, like bullet spread. Uh, I mean, it might have been okay. I was using Adrenaline Rush, so theoretically that probably helped a bit. Yeah. Are you going with a grenade-related character? I do not yet have a plan, so I don't know. Fair enough. I was going to do the Batarian Soldier, but if you want to run a soldier. grenade kit... 
Okay, you could go, if you go Batarian Soldier, I can go Base Human Engineer, because I have oh, that's I, lovely. maximum chain overload. So I will yeah. detonate absolutely everything for you. Yeah, I'm running Inferno Grenades and Incendiary Ammo, so that'll work Perfect. well. I think the Batarian Soldier is more and more becoming one of my favorite characters. Yeah, there was a time when he was definitely way up there for me, and for whatever reason I just haven't played him as much as of late, so he's kind of fallen, fallen down on my list a little bit, I guess, even though he definitely, he's definitely good. Just need to give him another chance again. Actually, I did play him earlier today a bit, I think. I think it's just his combo with the, uh... Uh, Grawl Spike Thrower, the Inferno Grenades, the Ballistic Blades, the Incendiary Ammo, it's just so much damage over time, you can just shoot up a room and run away and watch the heal <laughs> feed. Of course, the Grawl, that's another projectile weapon of host, it should be fine. Mm, yeah. Close quarters, no problem. How's your, uh, are you still doing the Andromeda playthrough? Did you ever finish it? I am. I'm still doing it. It's, uh... Oh, wow. Theoretically... So, I'm... First of all, I'm, like, the slowest player when it comes to any open-world game. Uh, and that's not an exaggeration. <laughs> and yeah. I'm 100%ing it, or doing as close as I could do to 100% while going in blind. So... Oh, nice. I... According to the game, and 72% of the way through... Okay. Most of that is side quests... Uh, so I highly suspect that I will get to a point quite soon where it's going to be almost entirely main quest and just zoom through the rest of the game from there. Aren't, uh, it's been so long, aren't some of the planets locked behind the progression of the main story? They may be, I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember either. Some, uh, very early on, some of them, yes. Um, but I don't know if they're going to be more later on because I haven't played before. Your approach to open world games seems a lot like mine. Like, I played through Elden Ring recently for the first time. Mm -hmm. And my first playthrough, I think it took like 130 hours, because I, I went everywhere. Yeah, and I mean, with Elden like, Ring, it's one of those things where, especially since, you know, there are difficult enemies everywhere you look, you know, who knows yes. how long it's going to take you to get through a given area, depending on how challenging it may be. Yeah, that's that's sort of the upside of exploring a lot in Elden Ring. You outlevel a lot of the content, and mm. the hard stuff becomes much more manageable. And does it scale at all with you? Uh, no, the uh, the the mobs everywhere are baseline. So basically, okay. if you if you if you show up in the starting zone at level 100, you're gonna ruffle stomp everything. Okay. I actually did play Elden Ring a little bit before. I'd never played a uh, Dark Souls game or anything like that before. So it was definitely a bit of a learning curve for me, and I just I just couldn't really get into it. I feel like... Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm same. I, I didn't enjoy the Dark, Dark Souls games at all. Like, but I love open world games, so that's why I gave yeah. it a chance, and I'm glad I did. I feel like I wouldn't necessarily completely write it off still to this day, but I think it was that... You know, I, I did go in blind for that as well, and I think that is the kind of game where, you know, if you want to do it that way, it's going to be, it's going to be even more challenging. Oh, yeah. So, I yeah, I mean, if, if you better. don't go in blind these days, like, there are so many get OP early guides on the, on YouTube, so if you, if you like, want to ruffle stuff, everything, you can. Yeah, like, I think just, I had, like... I don't know, what should I be prioritizing with my character at this point? What kind, what kind of area should I be going into? What should I be trying to do? Yeah. Like, I just had no clue. So, I think that oh. made it that much tougher. Oh. I was gonna turn off, uh, I was gonna Ballistic Strike and I turned off my, uh, shield. So, I've been there. Feel your pain. Also, I have the unfortunate, uh, 
I'm in the unfortunate position of not really enjoying the how the bosses are designed in Elden Ring, so sort of my main objective was to find a build that <laughs> let me <laughs> oh, <laughs> brute, yeah. brute, brute force my way through most challenging content instead of dodging everything, which I hate. Mm -hmm. I found the biggest two-hander I could and just staggered everything into the ground then, basically. Oh, come on. That's not fair. You are all to line up and let me kill you. Oh, that was close. Oh, hello. So out. Hope behind you. I have to remind myself it's just the two out there. Yeah. Gotta be careful. Don't get too crazy. That's, that's, that's the way I like it. <laughs> yeah. oh, hello. Nice. The boom. You line him up, I'll knock him down. <laughs> Oh, right behind us. Yep, I see them. I'll try and keep them off you. Right. Why am I moving right? That's yeah, silly. gotta move left, man. There we go, this is more like it. Now we're schmoovin'. That's a lot of mobs down in the middle there. And of course the stuff is on the other side of them. Okay, I'm kind of making my way over and around. Oh, hold on. That was not part of the plan. The middle is full, so oh. the sides should... Alright, I'm, I'm <laughs> just gonna gel this. The other side is completely clear, I think, like the far side from where you are. Okay, I will try that. Oh, except for this guy. Thank you. Um, I think it's clear. Yeah, it's I mean, let me run a check way, real quick. Yeah. yeah, this side is clear. Ah. Although they are making their way here. There's a prime at the LZ, I think that's just Shooting me. I need to remember that I I do have incinerate. I may be focusing on the chain overloads, but I do still have incinerate. Surprisingly easy. That well, wasn't too bad. We said that wave three. Yeah. Let's see about later objectives, right? Hey, nothing on this side. Uh, yeah. LZ. Must be. Oh. oh. Then as soon as I said nothing the... on that side, I got a rocket headed my way over my shoulder. But. Oh, nice. <laughs> More of that, please. Yeah, let's check the flank. Uh, Some of them are. There's more. 
Hunter here. Two hunters. Ah, like there's something. There's coming from LZ. Standing work. Do a little grenade run, getting low. Enemies inbound. Understood. They over there on you. Yeah, there's some stuff here. <laughs> oh, yep, you are right about that. Two primes. And a lot of other stuff. Hunter behind me, getting a little bit of flank here. Oh, LZ again. Nice. Uh, Prime at the back and the uh, Hunter. Or, yeah. The other side, I'll grab him. Careful, Hunter, right there. Oh, I think there's a prime behind me. Devices? Oh, another pizza? Really? Oh, man. Have you? Is this a modded game or something? No. With all the pizzas? <laughs> At least it's a decent pizza, the first one. All right, they are all. I'll try and lead them away from Elsie. I got oh. it. That's fairly clear here. I'll mess with these guys. Oh, and that guy apparently. That's the pyro though. Right there, I'm trying. Get a little annoying. Could be able to explode the prime now. That I can't. Uh, oh, well. I saw right when I nuked the prime that he was the one bar of armor left. Oh, yeah. I missed. You did 
you not. Stay alert. Enemy is regrouping. I had the reach, you had the flexibility. Oh, they're in this corner. A whole lot in this corner. You are not the wrong. That's actually a fair bit coming from LZ now. A couple hunters and uh, a rock trooper. Oh, oh that was oh. <laughs> so many explosions. That was a very timely ballistic blade explosion <laughs> right there. Surprised that was not a kill. Are you kidding me? Thank you. Prime is prime. Why? Why didn't he explode? I may have so, deprimed him. He is so full of, <laughs> so full of fire. <laughs> Up on the balcony, for lack of a better way of describing it. Also, yeah. Uh, I'm pretty useless from this range, to be honest. Okay. Does, uh, well, when I'm not Theoret. shooting the wall. This is my range. Now we're talking. <laughs> They're all dead. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was beautiful. Wow. Oh, LZ, a lot of stuff. Let's get in this pyro. Go boom! Oh, oh yeah. Wait for it. Oh, I miss. Oh, 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 bomber on us. Ah, uh, box, 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 get away! Oh. <laughs> Thank you for priming them, because I blew them all up, and it's the only way I was able to survive through that. I feel like uh, I'm getting an unfair amount of the points there since all your explosions are credited to me. That's fine. Since I don't care. I, when, I, <laughs> when I take this character with the way that I've set it up, where it's basically just all about detonating other people's primes, then I just accept the fact that I'm probably going to get very low score compared to others. Where is... Oh, oh there he is. I and I missed. 
Oh, it's two of them. Yeah, and I'm almost out of grenades. Oh, pyro behind you. Oh, I really thought that was the last enemy, so I don't blame you for running for the grenades. Mission accomplished. It's just me with the grenades, but I'm using a lot of them. <laughs> and understandably. They work pretty well. I'm guessing they spawned here behind us. Yeah, oh, they, they did. Them all. They definitely did. Down. Uh, bunch of rock troopers at LZ. Stop hiding. Oh, I missed. Hold on. No? Nope. Bada booms. Prime coming up. Oh, yep. No. That was interesting for that rock trooper. Oh, behind us. One pyro. Oh. Ow. Careful the bomber. Oh, thank you. This might kill me. Oh, prime. Yep. We might want to run away from here. Yeah. Oh, fuck me, I lost my upstrike. What? Oops. Oh, am I out of upstrikes? I might be completely out of like, I need to buy more. I am, uh, I'm running at it. Uh, ow. Gels. I think I'm only on two now. Thank you. Oh, come on, another prime, really? There's a prime behind us. Yeah, here as well. There's a lot of shit at LC. How are there still this many enemies left? I don't understand. We've killed a bunch. Yeah, LC's clear. Ah! Run to the like the way back of the map here. Alright, I'm seeing if I can snipe some people. That's a bomber ran top of me. Oh, my team member is hurt. Around the corner. Thank you. Throw our bombers here. Yep. Beware. of the prime. Only one more enemy. Yeah, there we go. All right, he's focused on me. He is ready for uh, exploding. There we go. Enemy is regrouping. Oh, I 
lost a lot of consumables around. Uh, so no, I'm on just one ops and two gels. Oh, wave 10. I do have a couple of... That's a lot of pyros. Yeah, let's work some magic. Oh, we can. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. We can't what have been far away happened? from a kill streak. Pyro on the flank. Oh. The cover very cleverly up here. Yeah. Sneaky, sneaky. Well, that is. Oh wow. Very nice. That was, that was intense. But man, that first first group up we started the escort, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> we might as well have nuked the thing. They just exploded. Yeah. Alright, they're all over here. Lots of hunters coming here. Pyro's on the this side as well. Primes. Okay, this flank is getting nasty. Oh, we should move down to the courtyard, there's nothing there. Okay. On like the far side. Okay, I may not have taken the preferred angle. Maybe, maybe just not kill anything, let them slowly yeah. walk over here. Maybe just this hunter. And those pyro. Oh, and the bomber. Ow, ow, ow! Ooh. Okay, I'm gelled. That is my last gel, though, I think. Oh no, second to last gel. Okay. Can we kill these guys? Oh, that prime's in a very early. bad spot. Yeah. I wouldn't recommend moving just yet. You know oh, what? you're already over there. I thought you were behind me. There we go. I'm trying to get this. Oh, look at that. Prime. Oh, okay. come on, Which come I on, missed. come on. <laughs> Oh, are you inside? Yeah. <laughs> it, looked, it looked like you were outside. I was house. close. I was close. <laughs> but I was okay. in. Nice. What's up, Banana? How are you? For math? How's it going? I mean, we had... That combo is pretty insane. Someone with incendiary grenade and then somebody with maximum overload chaining. Yeah. Uh, some of those groups were just <laughs> annihilated. I am surprised we didn't get any. We didn't get any kill streaks, did we? I don't think so. Some of those, they, they've got to be close. Yeah. So I mean, it's not always. I think we didn't necessarily get the kills on all of them because I think a lot of the time you opened with an early incendiary grenade, so you hadn't dealt yeah. a lot of damage to them yet, and then I detonated them, and you know we probably annihilated their shields, but might yeah, yeah. not have gone through their armor very much yeah and I, I do a lot of damage over time with this guy so some of them probably took a few seconds to burn out mm, true that would be awesome though if you prime them 
with the incendiary grenade. I detonate with the chain overload. It sets off that ridiculous combo. We run off, go somewhere else, and then five seconds later, when we're in a totally different area, then we get a kill streak because <laughs> yeah. the incendiary grenade kills them all around the same time with that dot. Yeah, cause they they got like they got the incendiary ammo, they got the inferno grenades, they got the uh, like the damage over time from the weapon because the uh, growl has like a dot when you hit them, and they also have the uh, the uh, oh, what's it called the incendiary ammo. We might not have been far away from getting a kill streak like that. But anyways, we have a couple of spots if anyone else from chat would like to hop in here. And if there's anything in particular that you'd like for us to do for the next one, then let us know. We can make it happen. Or we can try. Or we can try. That was a duo highlighted by incendiary grenades plus maximum chainage with the overload. Inferno grenades, at least, and incendiary ammo. Yeah, Litz, when are you hopping into the Andromeda MP? Hold on, I just took a huge bite of food. Okay. So, good question. So as I was saying a, a little while ago, apparently, I'm supposedly 72% through with the Andromeda campaign. So obviously that means it's not like we're about to finish the Andromeda campaign, but we're at least kind of close. So the long-term answer is probably when we finish the campaign, then we will basically use that time slot for... Andromeda multiplayer, because the problem is right now we have all of the obvious weekend slots already accounted for. Fridays is Andromeda campaign, Saturdays is Mass Effect 3 multiplayer, Sundays is Pyre multiplayer, and then, you know, they're like, I could do a weekday, maybe every now and again, but that's certainly a lot more difficult on my end and probably a lot more difficult to get the people in to do a multiplayer stream. So, what I'm thinking is that at least while we're waiting to finish the Andromeda campaign, I might see if every now and again, if I, you know, finish up work early or I'm taking a day off from work, then that opens up a weekday time slot. And what I'd probably do is I'd shuffle things around a little bit for that one week. I do Andromeda campaign on that sort of strange weekday that I'm taking time off or that I'm, you know, getting out of work early. And then that would allow for a Friday Andromeda stream because I'm assuming that trying to do a multiplayer Andromeda stream on a random weekday is probably not going to be the easiest thing to make happen. So that's, like that's the idea, at least, I think, at this point. I think Warmout one is a choice. Oh yeah, let's get Warmout in. So yeah, basically the answer is short term, it's gonna have to be sort of a, a one-off kind of thing, you know, a no set schedule for them because all of our time slots are currently accounted for. Warmout, I'm not currently seeing you showing up for some reason. But then once we finish Andromeda, the campaign, then suddenly we have a, an actual, more sustainable time block that we can just dedicate to that. Have you, have you played the multiplayer at all? Not at all. I have one time accidentally pressed from the Apex missions... Oh, do right. an apex mission in multiplayer that's like no 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 don't do this yet don't do this yet and it had i started to see a really cool cinematic but then i had to cancel out of it so i, I do want to still see that cinematic it looked cool it looked entertaining and exciting and you know i have to say i'd like to believe a pretty good sense as to what the andromeda multiplayer is going to be like after having done a lot of mass effect 3 multiplayer but 
Yeah, that's a good way to kind of get hyped up for the first few matches of it. That's true. But outside of that, no. So for all intents and purposes, no. So the thing is, I was trying to get far enough in the campaign that I wasn't going to get any major enemies spoiled by doing multiplayer. Like, I didn't want to just show up, like, and before I even started the campaign, do multiplayer, and then it's like, okay, well, I've seen all the enemies, so this dramatic enemy reveal that's supposed to be a big deal in the campaign is pretty meaningless to me because I've already seen that a whole bunch. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's sort of weird to think about the reveal of the first Atlas in the ME3 campaign. Like, we're, we're so used to having waves upon waves of atlases. But exactly. the first real reveal was pretty epic when they sort of dropped down from the sky on Sir Kesh. My favorite, though, is, and the one that I always use as my example, was the Banshee reveal at the Ardat Yakshi oh, yeah. Monastery. Like, that is one of possibly my favorite mission in Mass Effect 3. It is so good, the way that that is executed. So, basically, my thought process was, I don't want to ruin any dramatic yeah. enemy reveals like that obviously going in blind i have no idea if that's going to happen in andromeda but i didn't want to mess with that so now that i have received word that i do not need to be concerned about enemies getting spoiled in multiplayer anymore for andromeda let's see if warm now shows up warm i sent him an invite uh okay because i'm not seeing him for some reason wait am i okay. getting what the heck? I'm getting a... I'm getting a little pop-up window with a subset of my friends, and then I'm getting a larger pop-up window with all of my friends, it seems. And Vormath, you, I'm sorry, but you're not on this little window. You might be on this big window, but you're not yeah, on the magic. little window. I don't know what to make of that. Uh, I sent you a second one, Vormav. Did you get it? Could also do the old public True. trick. We could do that. Worst comes to worse. Should we do that for meth? Should we go with a public lobby and do a Condor Collector Platinum or something like that? Try one more, Tark. Oh, okay, though. Poor uh... is uh, trying to overcome the power of the EA magic. All right, invite sent. See, unfortunately, Vormav, you need to roll a nat 20. Yeah. Hey. There we go. There's Vormav. So yeah, out of curiosity, I mean, while we're sort of on the topic of Andromeda multiplayer, so obviously I've never played Andromeda multiplayer before, and I've exclusively done Mass Effect 3 multiplayer streams. To what extent are people also interested in Andromeda multiplayer stuff, or is it, uh, no, I draw the line at Mass Effect 3 multiplayer and my interest does not cross over into Andromeda? Uh, you mean for the Discord? For, well, or no, like, I, like Discord general. obviously has it, but in general, for, like, if I were to try to do a Mass Effect Andromeda multiplayer stream. Uh, you know, obviously I could I could just pug with people and hopefully, I like, I have no idea. Are, are there a lot of pugs still in Andromeda? Are there more or less than in Mass Effect 3? I mean, I hope there's enough that worse comes to worse. I could just go with pugs, but... Uh, there, there are definitely pugs, uh, pug lobbies in, in Andromeda. I, uh, I'm fairly certain that there's uh, a lot more players in Mass Effect 3. Uh, okay. Of course, the... Uh, there are plenty of people on the server that play both. Mm -hmm. So you, would, you wouldn't have sort of as big a pool of uh, players to pick from. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, it's uh, it's definitely not a dead multiplayer by any stretch. Uh, Vormau, I'm getting some uh, feedback on my own voice from your uh, mic, I think. Yeah. Or might, it, it might have been you, I, I just heard myself in any, in any case. I don't. I did not hear anything from Vormav, so it might be from me. Yeah, oh, it's it's gone now, so it's fine. Okay, interesting. Well, hello again, Vormav. How are you? Hello again. Hello. I continue to exist. 
Well, oh, let's see if we can change that. <laughs> oh. Oh. So All right, let's see. What is, can we do? What can we do? Quickly. <laughs> well, <Let's> to, be, <laughs> you. to be fair, oh, no. <laughs> so bad. Poor map does say that quite frequently, and I've often asked myself, how do I respond to that? <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, so uh, if there's anything that you guys would like to see us do request wise, let us know. Otherwise, we could go with whatever we want, or if we want to just voluntarily take on some kind of challenge or theme, we could go that route as well. Whatever works for you guys. Well, I mean, if you have anything, I'm not, uh, uh, let's not opposed see. to it. Let's see. So I think we did the 300 one <laughs> earlier today. Um, Hold on. Let me check what? something that I should what? know the answer to. What? But I will double check nonetheless. Was it Sparta? It, this is Sparta, indeed. All right. That is. Oh no. Okay. No. Never. Good thing I double checked. I would have been wrong. Okay. Ne okay. Never mind. The other thing that I had thought of, not applicable. Never mind. <laughs> okay. Uh, next week, maybe. Next week. Got my days wrong. Uh, but we could always go back to a, a previous challenge. Um, you know, last week we did a whole bunch of the, the what did we end up calling them? Random rank, the sort of alternate uh, randomizer ones, which we, we could go for again if we just feel like, ah, we don't really know what we want to do. Let's just throw a little bit of chaos into the equation. Or, you know, if you just want to go for whatever, we can just go for whatever. Yeah. Tark, was it you who last week we were describing the randomizer the alternate randomizer setup and you said maybe i'll i have to go right now but maybe i'll be back later and we can check it out uh yeah i think i did just like the first match of the stream and then i, w I wasn't able to come back oh well i don't I, remember I, think... I don't remember us talking about the randomizer that, that i i seem to recall i, I think he's due i believe you are due all right, so in that case, why don't we just go over the basics then? So, Vormav, as you know, you're familiar with this, we did this several times last week, but the idea is we are going to run two random number generators for each person. One for your character and one for your weapon. We are going to run the random number generator such that it can give you any number from 1 to 59 for characters, because there are 59 characters, and 1 to 62 for weapons because there are 62 weapons. The way it works is if you get the number one, you're picking your favorite character or your favorite weapon. If you get the number 59 for characters or 62 for weapons, you're taking your least favorite character or weapon and whatever number you happen to get in between. So I feel like we're playing Pathfinder. <laughs> so that's the, the that's the idea. Okay. There is of course, you know, it's up to you to determine what you think the 17th best weapon for, or, well, favorite, I should say. What your 17th favorite or 23rd favorite character or weapon might be. So it's per, uh, entirely up to personal preference. Doesn't necessarily have to be the, the established consensus opinion for, you know, what ought to be in that position. It is just your own personal opinion. Fair enough. So you are allowed to have hot takes. In fact, they are <laughs> encouraged. Yeah, my my favorite character is a very hot take, to be honest. Oh, okay. All right, then. Well, in that case, Tark, perhaps we ought to start with you. Let me get the... <laughs> right okay. I mean... You gotta, I guess you're, you're rolling gonna... <laughs> so we can see the result. Yeah, let me, let me get this up here. Okay, so... Let's start with the character, which is... One out of 59. So, so it has nothing to do with the way they're listed in the multiplayer, and it's purely based on my... Uh, purely your, your personal interpretation. Opinion. Okay. So if you were to... Like, you don't need to go in and rank every single character right now, but... Yeah, gut feeling. Exactly, exactly. Get the, the right general... General Bob. Oh my god, what? No. Really? No. My, fa my favorite? That did not just happen, especially after he said that his favorite character was a hot take. 
<laughs> no. Oh, uh, oh, curious. <laughs> well, I have selected my favorite character. Okay. Well, let's. Oh, let's... good choice. Excellent choice. Okay. I, I am curious to see, but I'll, I'll roll your weapon now as well. So this is one out of 62. And for this one, I swear, if you get number one, it's 45. 45 out of 42. 45. So, so it's one of my least favorite weapons. Not basically. your absolute least favorite weapons, but it's it's st- it's scraping the bottom at forty five. It's yeah. getting yeah. pretty close. There are well, a lot gonna, that are around. I'm gonna there, make probably. it. I'm I'm gonna make it a bit easier and stick with the same weapon category, like the assault rifle. So basically, one of my least favorite assault rifle. Oh wait, is this your favorite? Your favorite it's... character? Oh, wow. I am gonna go with the face then. Oh, interesting. That seems forty-two seems very appropriate for the face. I, I so uh, I did not rank my stuff last week. However, just before today's stream started, I did rank all of my characters. I rushed through them a bit, so they're probably not perfectly accurate. And I ranked about a third, no, about half of the weapons, which also was a bit rushed, so they may not be perfectly accurate. But let's see, my my face in. Did I write that one down yet? I guess I didn't, but I think I was going to put it a fair bit higher than that. Not yeah, like it, top it's tier. It's higher but... than that for me as well. Okay. Shall I? Get, shall we go in order? Tark, me, then Vormav? Go for it. All right. So, let's see. Can anyone top Tark's luck here? I mean, you can't do better than that from a character standpoint. For me, it will be... Oh, no. Well... It's 52. Oh. Let's see. So I, if I refer to my list here, this might actually be someone that I took last week when we were doing the randomizer stuffs. This might actually be someone that I took last week when we were doing this. This might be a little bit of a hot take. A little bit of a hot take. I don't know. I don't know. Edibot? Oh, the Huntress, really? Yeah, I'm just I'm not an not really an infiltrator person. Not re- with one well, or two you, exceptions. You saw my fourth least favorite last week. <laughs> true, true. Okay, now I will go weapon out of sixty-two, which will be. Oh, let's hope for a higher number. Nineteen. Okay, I Oops. think I did number that far down. Okay. Not necessarily sure this is a fantastic combination, but it could be worse. Hold on, let me get rid of this stuff. It probably could still be worse. It is the Paladin. Ah, good job. That's not bad. Okay, so that's me. That was, what, 52 and 19, I think? Yeah. All right, so now Vormav. Vormav, what are you going to get? Let's go character first. Out of 59, you get 11. Very good. Very good. And then for weapon, whenever you're ready, I can give you that. Okay, out of 62. Ormav, you are a lucky person today. You got number two. Oh, (laughs) your second favorite weapon. Second favorite weapon. 11th favorite character. That is... I mean, across those two, that is very, very good luck. That might it, be the th- highest these, combo we've seen. These may not go well together. Let's figure, I need to figure out what character that is. I know what weapon that is. That's easy. I mean, you can probably work your way back to 11 for your yeah, character I, as well. I, I considered writing down a... I had the time to do it last week, and I almost did it, and then I started, and I realized, no, I, 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 I feel bad putting it into writing because I don't want yeah. to... My, my favorite lists have a tendency to fluctuate. Mm-hmm. So it's, regrettably, it's too low for Vol's mercenary. It's 
So what is your second favorite weapon? We Wait, saw oh. your favorite last time. Oh. Wait, did you say Claymore? My favorite was Claymore, uh, and my second favorite's Widow. Oh, really? I would not have guessed that. I don't know what I would have guessed. Probably another shotgun of some variety, but I don't know which. Most shotguns are in, are, are fairly high up on my ranking. Maybe I'd guess Raider? I don't know. That, hmm... So, Thaston, but well, I mean, collectively, this was a pretty the, lucky roll for all of us. The fury with the typhoon, that's very interesting. Oh, dear. I wanted to go Spitfire, but someone has already taken Spitfire. <laughs> Yeah, you know what? I think that feels about right to me. I'm going to go uh, Vanilla Human Soldier. What number was this again? 11? 11. Hmm. I mean, you were saying last week that you're a big fan of that. I, I do like a lot of the Vanilla Human classes. That one's... It's not that high but... up there for me, but it's it's also... It's in a decent spot, I think. It, it's feeling about in the right range for either he, Vanilla Human Soldier, Vanilla Human Vanguard, or it might actually, it, it is in Volus Mercenary territory. Interestingly, you took my favorite assault rifle and my favorite shotgun. <laughs> That'll change. And that is also true for me. And also, I am looking at the list that I've made, and apparently the my 11th character is also a base human. Oh, a different variety. And it is also the base human that I played in the previous match. Yeah, oh, nice. nice. I like Lids. that guy too. And Lids, you're taking my favorite pistol. Really? Yes. I do like a lot of pistols, but the Paladin, it's, it's not that high up there for me as pistols go. Like, it's it's very close between the uh, Paladin and the Talon. Oh, you know what? I did forget a weapon here that I think probably deserves to make the list. Let's go... I forget this one? I think I do. Yeah. I think there was a time where the human soldier was a bit higher on my rating. But it's dropped down a little bit over the time, I guess. I have adjusted my list to account for the weapon that I forgot about. But I think I'm good whenever you guys are. So for Tark, um, it was, is what, character number one and weapon yes. 45, was it? 42, I think. 42, something like that. Life, universe, etc. Uh, yes, meaning of everything. I guess I, I got 52 for character, which was not very high, and then I got... 19 for weapon, which is decent, but not amazing. And then Warm I've got 2 and 11, which is pretty sweet. Not complaining. May not be my favorite character after playing it with the face stunt. 
Yeah, it's it's funny how these combos can kind of yeah. impact our opinions. Right. I, if, if I were like to rank my favorite builds, uh, like it would not be the um, Wallace Merc build, to be honest. Like sometimes last week we had ones where we'd have people with low rankings for both their character and their weapon, but they'd at least work pretty well together. Or one was a high ranking, one was a really r low ranking, but Stop! at least they were pretty synergistic. Got it! I need to remember how to play this character real quick. Excuse me, ma'am. Ma'am. Oh, that's a grenade. Yeah, it is. Oh. Did not realize that that had uh over to you. An explosion. But I'll take it. What are you doing, Lids? Uh, that was not me! <laughs> I wish that <laughs> was me. But it was not. Oh, I'm too busy dying over here. <laughs> warm out is on a grabbing spree right here. I'm so jealous. <laughs> Cut it out. It's a fine work, team. Enemy is regrouping. Time to reload. Feels so weird running for ammo with the mark. Copy that. What do you usually take on him? Uh particle rifle. Ah, okay, I see now. I flew in our bus for me. Actually, guessing which enemy the oh uh, stuff gets passed to the dark channel, even when I can't see. Over here, there we go. That's more like it. Hey, I used my shield boost. Bioware. Hang on. I owe you. Oh no! Wait, no, never mind. I will now no longer be on that way. Good. Yes, that would no. Interrupt grabbiness. It's not that the facing is that bad, it's just I hate the f feel of it. I don't know, it's, it's very <laughs> hard yeah. to describe. I like it on the Turian soldiers specifically. It's fairly underwhelming. Now, but it's confident. I mean, it's shooty, it's shooty goody. Hey, uh, guess what, Tark? What? More pizzas. Oh. Ow. You guys had a lot of pizza on your duel? Uh, <laughs> even before that. Have we, we had, had like... anything else? We had one <laughs> escort. That's all I remember. We had I don't think we had a single upload or target. For about two hours now, probably. Okay. Ow. Existence. 
That's it. Enemy is oh, I will give the face and its magazine size. It's fairly forgiving. Here they come. It's almost like Hostiles. the uh, Bitfire. I still used my shield boost game. What's going on? Oh no, you can stay right there, Centurion. No, you can stay right there, Centurion. I'm see that way. I got you. Thank you. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Better still. Better still. Also, the sound it just makes, it's, it, it feels like a fa fake gun. <laughs> I don't know. I can kind of so get that, weird. yeah. I can see that. Got it! Oh, that was your decoy. Yes. Oh, I'm not the only one? Falls to the decoys? Uh, apparently not. I don't experience it as much because well, I'm usually the one playing with the decoy. <laughs> Still other enemies around this dude? Or am I just trying over and over again to detonate this atlas without any collateral damage? There's a turret. There's not a turret. Next turret. took the entire wave. Run, I dare you. Okay, it's a preferably not in that direction. And therefore I will shoot you in the butt. And I missed that one. Maybe I was a little bit, a little bit harsh on the face then. I mean, it, it's sort of hard to decide on the fly what your 40 second favorite yeah. weapon is. Yeah, so no, understandably, it doesn't have to be perfect. Wait, what kind of pizza run is this? Um, um they have the pizza. We're trying to get it back. Yes. Right. I hear a phantom. I felt the fact. Ah, it came out. It's okay. No, it's man. Oh, there's a turret down there, right by the target. Oh, turret being set up near LZ. Come on, come on! Damn it, turret is up. Are down by the target has been destroyed. Uh, excuse me, you're supposed to hit the target now? Target was supposed to be prime now. There we go. Channel. 
Where are you going? I'm sure it had to come in. I'm telling you, man, that was the worst, worst wall I've ever seen in my life. The most ill-behaved wall you could ever imagine. God, all the phantoms in the world are right here. I'm hit! Check fire! Well, the enemy always gets dark channel instead. I get my shield boost off and still Got it! Ooh. I don't like this part of the map Ow. anymore. Oh! Hello. Oh, I'm getting out of here. I don't blame you. Minus, I think. Wait, where was that coming from? Thought it was. Maybe it was you. Cut it out! What is up with that phantom? Yeah. You were in front of me along with my decoy and my drone, and I was stealthed, and it still fired at me. Never mind. Thank you. Oh, there is another one over there, though. She's dead. Oh, Phantom came Hang up. On. Oh, yep. Uh, well, that might be a Vormath. Oh, no, never mind. She just. Oh, wait. No, I just didn't revive you. Never mind. Uh, and now I'm dead. Lovely. Uh, there's a Phantom between us. Just, just so you know. Never mind. Oh, now there's a vendor behind me. I owe ya. Well done. A lot of Atlases over there. There's also a phantom right there. Fourth fucking shield boost that doesn't give me any shield. Hey, more map. Oh, more map. Uh huh. No, 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 no. Bad. No, don't do that. <laughs>
Marauders approaching. Oh, that's all the mobs. Oh, yeah, no, there is nothing over here. You guys oh, definitely have everything. You're welcome to have some of it. Oh, okay, I guess I'll tag along. being set up inside the building. Everyone deployed. That came from behind me. Oh, that's a turret. It's in there, Tark, around the corner. That's up. Yeah. It's hitting me through the container, though, which is peculiar. <laughs> Thank you. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's not good. That's very not good. Atlas. Of course, there's an Atlas. I owe you. Oh yeah, there are there are multiple turrets in that room, Tark. Oh, that's a really bad oh time. My. That's a really bad time to be on cooldown. Okay, one turret down. Ow. I'm hit! Two turrets down. Shield down! Oh, that's also a turret. Is that a turret? No. This would be escorting the pizza? I guess so. It's a new uh, automatic Uber car that needs some help. There is a phantom runner on this corner. Uh, she went up the ladder. Yeah. And she's dead. No, I'm afraid there are more over here. Oh, you know what? Not a bad idea. Two phantoms behind us. And coming down the ladder. Oh, that's a phantom. Did you try and grab a phantom? No, that was just because I was on one bar of HP. Oh, okay. Ow, ow. Ignore, ignore me, Atlas. Ignore me, Atlas. Oh, thank you for the shield boost. No one has time for that. Yes, turret. Fire at the decoy. Data received in full. Good work. All right, now I have the permanent uh, shieldless sound effect and whatnot, which is lovely. Set? I think it's gone. Yeah, I got it. Get to the extraction zone. Got it. Let's go.
last channel. Oh, who's behind me? An Atlas. That's the wall. Get fire. Oh, that's exciting. No, more men. Choose life. Oh, just in time. We've seen closer just today. Probably, yes, but still. Had a lot of close calls, I suppose, in the past several hours. Oh, let me change the weapons so I don't forget. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. I have made that mistake many times now. Yep. Why am I using the shuriken? <laughs> all right well we do have a spot if anyone else from chat would like to hop in here let us know if there's anything you'd like for us to do from a challenge standpoint or anything like that otherwise we can uh, voluntarily go with the challenge if we feel so inclined otherwise just oh well hold on slasher comes in with characters oh. and weapons Slasher, I mean, there is there is a fourth spot here that may have your name on it. But let's see what Slasher has schemed up. How merciful. Krogan Warlords World. for all. Okay. That's certainly not bad. And what sniper Wait rifle are we using? It. Right, yep. Wait for it. There's always a catch. Javelin Widow Mantis. All right. Javelin Widow. Mantis. Notice well, those are all single shot weapons. Yeah. I think I do have a preference between those three. It may not be the one that you guys. It might be the one that you guys like the least, so. I don't really care. I am terrible with single shot snipers, no matter what. Well, I feel your pain. But you have an arena and an enemy as well. Oh, it's gonna be a uh, glacier hazard, isn't it? With collectors. Jade oh. collector. Well, that's not half a bad uh, of a sniper map. So, did you guys have a preference for the the weapons? No. No. Neither of you. Okay. Um. Well, there's definitely one that I don't want to use. Outside of javelin. I was gonna say Mantis. I'm happy to go Mantis, but I could definitely go Widow if somebody really wants Mantis. Was Widow the one that you just took format? Yeah. Okay. I mean, I yeah, I can take Widow in that case if you don't want to do it twice in a row, or if sure. you do want to do it twice in a row, then that's fine. As I said, no preference. All right. I guess I'll go. I'll go Widow then. I'll take the Mantis, I guess. Unless you really want the... Don't really want the Javelin warm-up. Javelin's fine. Yeah. 
Well, I mean, I'm not sure I would describe it that way, but. Well, good thing about the uh, Krogan Warlord, you could just ignore whichever weapon you're using. Yeah, but we can't add a little bayonet to the end. That's true. And Slasher definitely knows this. Slasher says he'll join for the next one. Okay, gotcha. Alright, so do we embrace the sniper rifle stuff? Or do we try to, as Tark was just saying, ignore our weapon altogether and go with the more typical warlord route and melee everything? Well, it is the Unga, it's the Bunga. <laughs> I have done a lot of melee today already, so you know what? I think I'm gonna I'm gonna go the sniper route. I'm gonna go the sniper route. I'm shocked. I haven't spec for headshot damage. How could you? Yeah. Why wouldn't Nothing. you do that on the warlord? So, Jade Collector, all right. Oh, yeah, we know the enemy. Oh, yes, I haven't said that yet, but let me do that. At least we have the, uh... Should be able to grab some headshots. Even me. I'm going for a pure sniper warlord. There is basically no armor bonus. It helps. Powers don't matter. I mean, I guess I could take Cyclonic. All right. Do the, does the hammer count as a tech power? Which hammer are you talking about? Either one of them. The electric hammer is... Yeah? Eh, I'll go with the uh, sniper rifle amp. Can't be bother respecting. And to resist the urge to immediately check the enemy. That's, uh, that's an interesting looking hammer you have there, Tark. Thank you. It's, uh, it's a little pointier and more spear-like than I would usually see. Oh, right, I can't grab! Excuse me, sir. Please stand still. Excuse me, sir. Please stand still. Please stand still so that I can shoot you in the face. Thank you. Oh, I missed. Where'd they go? Nowhere. They're just not here anymore. Time to reload. Enemies inbound. Oh, hello. No, don't duck. That's illegal. You're not allowed to duck. Must be related to a nemesis. Where'd he go? 
Oh crap. That was almost a double headshot. Oh, the awesome. very important abomination. Yep. I was gonna shoot the important abomination. Yeah, but you didn't, did you? I shot him the, like seconds after he died. Dude. Oh, excellent. Oh, was it running? Oh, oh, oh. oh. Less excellent. Um, I tried to shoot him. The Praetorian did not care. I, I, I saw that actually. Both parts. Yeah, I oh, regret well, well. nothing. <laughs> oh, um, okay then. I noticed a bit too I late regret nothing I either. didn't have any charges on my hand. It's okay, let's go this way. The Praetorian is to your right and oh. it's very weak. Relatively speaking. Yeah, he might have regained his barriers. Me to melee kill you. But it was your decision. I didn't want to do this. It didn't have to be this way. I got you, Warmav. I killed him for you. Um, thank you. <laughs> Much uh, yeah, appreciated. Warren's doing that.
quick scope. We'll take it. And then immediately make it clear that that was a complete coincidence. I prefer to call that practice. Oh, come on! Well, oh, oh! thank you. <laughs> we'll borrow armor left. I sniped him from across the map. <laughs> to bail you out. Nope, nope, nope. Bad, bad, bad. Stop that. Stop that. But nope, stand still. Stand still. Excuse me, excuse me, sir. Sir. Sir, I'm gonna need you to stand still, please. Sir, I'm gonna need you to stand still, please. Just steal all of your Praetorian kills while I'm at it. Yeah, I was out of ammo, so. <laughs> Just as well. <laughs> this is like the Valiant, only single shot and less damage per bullet. Thank you. Every time the target spawns, I just need to look behind Tark. Come on! That's not the target. It's behind Tark. That's the target. Hello. Uh oh. Uh oh. Thank you. Uh -oh. I'm going with that. Oh, hey. Hey, Bournemouth. Uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, hello. I mean, you had an opportunity there. Um, it would have taken me a lot more resources to do that. Okay. That spot was in the Scion Crossfire. What the heck? I definitely hit. So did that. <laughs> that definitely did. Enemy force approaching. Oh, no, that, that is not close. I'm not an infiltrator. Multiple? For what? Three of all nations? No, that wasn't three of one. That was two of one. Okay, but we'll take it. Way is faster? No, oh, your way is faster. I ran into a wall. Unless. Oh, nope. Right. 
I was too busy laughing, sorry. Or my Krogan was, anyway. Wait a ow, second. Ow, ow. Wait a second! I'm on to you, Vorman. Oh. <laughs> what do you mean? You know <laughs> what I mean. <laughs> Adventure again. Oh, hold on. One moment, sir. Because I keep on dying right next to the enemies who are going to immediately stomp me like this. That's why. Yeah. If when you are meleeing with a sniper rifle, if it totally changed your melee animation so that you're actually stabbing them with the rifle. It had occurred to me. Particularly since I'm using a javelin. <laughs> right. And especially with the... What is it? It's one of the piercing mods that makes it look like it has some kind of point on the end. Yeah. Oh, 
Thanks. With two headshots to kill a captain. Same. Not that it's bullshit. <laughs> It is bold. Uh, excuse me, Tark, please. Some personal space. <laughs> no. Some respect for the dead. Nope. Recently dead? I mean, let's be honest. It was, it was a while ago at that point. Still. Oh, um, uh, one moment. I'm on my way. There is uh, everything in between you and me, but I am on my way. the armpit. No, oh, I did it again. No Britney Spears quotes. Don't go there. Came around the corner and saw one part of saw and I was like, oh, well. Poor uh, math! <laughs> I definitely was not just waiting to shoot that guy in the head until he finished with his whole possession thing so that I could actually hit him in the head. Only for a big Krogan to come into frame. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting very patiently. Thank you very much. Time today I've seen devices. Uh, it's not device. It's you, you have to disarm the pizza. <laughs> right. Oh, we're actually we're putting the pizza in the oven right now. We have four different pizzas that have been ordered here. This one is um, pepperoni with extra cheese. Oh, that's not. Good. Now it's veggie. Oh, I, I guess that means it. Yeah, it's yours. Yeah, I couldn't do the previous one. I understand. Good memory, though. <laughs> This 
This one is Hawaiian. Oh no. <laughs> I was curious to see how you'd react to that. Your Krogan has a redundant stomach. Might need it for that one. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Please, no butt lasers. I am stuck. Oh, okay. Apparently, it's a party over here. <laughs> Turn around. You guys are almost in exactly the same spot, in exactly the same point of your reload animations. <laughs> That time. Outstanding work. Yes, I agree. It's so sad standing next to Warma watching him one shot stuff, and I need two shots to kill an abomination. Same. You guys left me with the javelin. I'll just yeah. point that out. No. <laughs> that definitely did hurt. How are you guys doing? We're just taking a little well, snooze. I think that didn't work. That didn't work according to plan. Where am I? It's giving I'm me some distress. distress. Oh. More ammo. Why? Why are you asking? No reason. You weren't perhaps shooting a uh, possessed abomination up my butt, were you? No, no, no. Meleeing it. Wanted to melee him at the very end. Team well done, team. Nope. <laughs> What's up, Steel Wolf? This definitely wasn't a slasher creation. I feel violated. This de definitely was not slasher art specifically requesting that we take single-shot sniper rifles on Warlords. Again, let's change back the weapon <laughs> to something sane. Yep, good call. Good call. Hello, Enum. How I, I don't know if the... all three of those would be in my top 10, but probably top 15. Which one of those three is the lowest? We know Mantis, or rather, uh, Widow is two. Mantis is probably the lowest on the list. I would hope so. I mean, you never I'm know. a fan. I mean, of all I'm, the... I'm genuinely a fan. Yeah, of all the starter weapons, it's not bad. There, there are times when I use it unironically. Yeah. I legitimately almost voluntarily took it this time. Well, with all this talk of pizza, now I have to go make my dinner, which will not be pizza. <laughs> no! All right, we'll catch you later, Vormap. Enjoy your dinner. Thank you very much. Enjoy your games. GG's. Damn it.
I might have to butt out as well. It's 3.30 a.m. here. Holy hell. Ah, okay. Understandable. No worries. <laughs> yeah. You have fun. I think Slasher is joining you, though. I think Slasher said he was looking to hop in. Yeah. All right. You guys have fun. All Thanks right. for the matches. GG's. Catch you later.